Hey guys and welcome back to another video. Today, I have some highlights from unlocking the Heated Madness Blueprint, in Solo DMZ. This is not a guide on how to get it, I will leave a link to a guide down below. I was really struggling to do this solo so drop a like if you enjoy the video. I do not have any footage of me getting the barrel as I did that first game and it is by far the easiest part to unlock. Starting with the optic you have to swim down with a rebreather and look for it in a hidden area. The first time I did this, I had no problems getting the part but when I got to the chemical plant and heard that there were people nearby I waited a bit. Until this happened. Well, I gave it another try and this time without any issues. For the magazine, you have to look for it in these bunkers. If you do not have a gas mask you will take damage and if you do, it annoys the hell out of you anyways. When I found it I had no problems extracting with it. Now I was at 3 out of 5 parts, the muzzle and underbarrel was by far the hardest to get. My first attempt I did not make it that far. Second attempt I tried going for the grip, I had two AQ laptops and was in the alpha cluster when operators came by. My second attempt I rushed to the Alpha Cluster and found two AQ laptops on the way. Had to go to another bunker to pick up the last laptop.
Then for the muzzle, I got in at the Tarek bridge opening to try and get to the chemical plant the fastest. I had picked up a car battery and jumper cables in Almazra beforehand to get to the Alpha cluster right away. Went to pick up the R4D detector and rushed to the Alpha cluster. I had seen that you get unlimited tries on the number pad so I just found two of the numbers then tried different combinations until it unlocked. Then I got the muzzle and safely extracted. This blueprint is really cool and I liked the way of unlocking it. Have you unlocked this yet? Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Peace.